That's for sure, with all of the smoke. All right, welcome to Operation Blind Tune. The, the task is pretty simple. Stop Advent from retaliating. Kill all of them. Save the civilians. And have a nice party afterwards. That's exactly what we're going to do. Specifically the partying part. I, I like that one. Let me make a very for short phone call. I'll be back in one or two minutes. Menace one five. Hostile forces are attacking the outpost. Eliminate all enemy units and protect those civilians. Advent came in hot, and so did we. You won't have a concealed position for deployment on this one. All right, welcome back. Here we go again. So I saw some sort of Psy operative there. Wouldn't be super surprised if we will find some of them. Let's move on. Our first task is basically save civilians. Don't trigger too many enemies. Yeah, that's about it. Pretty simple task, I know. Go on, head to the ship. These here are four civilians. Let's just take a short look if all of them are real civilians. If this is the case, and you can be damn sure who's going to move over there. Oh, I just called in an evac. That was not what I was um, planning to do. Yeah, Battle Scanner just discovered you, bitch. We all know where you are. Alright, Dupa de Zor. Let's just move him over here. I'll take the high road. Grappling hooks are just super strong. Look at that. We just can move over there. Lightning hands. Single point of damage. Fire pistol, yet another point of damage. And let's use our new fanfire ability because I really want to see it. Yeah, pretty much we killed him. I like it. We'll save a bunch of civilians next turn, that's for sure. This is going to be insta-win, 
<clears throat> by rescuing all of these guys, like four of them. Never seen that many civilians in one corner. Terence, that's good to hear. If you're preferring this stream over a movie, then we're doing something right. After this uh, session, after this uh, mission, however, I think I'm going to take a short uh, lunch break uh, because I haven't eaten anything so far. And I want to stay fit. So I'm just going to take a 30 minutes break afterwards, I think. Uh, but I'll leave the stream running so you guys can also take your breaks if you so desire. I gotcha. You're safe. One, two. We already got three of them. Position confirmed. That's number four. This here is number five. Go. Six. Status confirmed. We've secured a civilian contact. And seven. Easy peasy lemon squeezy. Solid copy. Easy peasy. That was good. Now we just need to neutralize all of the enemies and we're done. But without the time pressure, this is much, much easier. So, bro, as long as he's in cover, you'll take it, uh, a minus to your shots. You should know about that. You're an advent officer. Moving on target location. Got a group of hostiles over here. All right. The captain would serve our purposes nicely. If it can be disabled. Acknowledged. Multiple civilian contacts have been secured. For now, okay. let's move here. So if Dopa moves here, we're triggering these guys. I don't want to do that at the moment. I much rather want to move here and use kill zone instead. Alright, since we know that there are so many enemies near, let's just for the for the sake of okay. of not overdoing it, move a little bit back. And everyone else is on Overwatch. Dopa Desor moves here, which is not going to trigger, because everything here is full cover. Well, I guess it's fair to say it's pretty much on now. Wow, a gatekeeper.
Are we triggering these guys? No, we aren't. Because I really felt more secure if we weren't triggering them. Let's start by, like, killing some of these chrysalids, for instance. That would be nice. Oh, nice. They can dodge. Well, <clears throat> we could just use a grenade to get rid of them, I suppose. But that would first of all require us to take a new position. But luckily, we have the most imbalanced item ever, also called Grappling Hook. So, see you later, and off you go. All right, Defcon. Let's move you to here. Again, not triggered. All right. So, plasma grenade. Too bad, I was already falling in love with this high ground. Could we maybe only kill half of the high ground? Yeah. No. So in that case, let's just get rid of it. So they just fell down. Let me shortly answer the questions in the chat in a second. Alright, this chrysalid is down. And I don't see any other chrysalids, the third one already died. So yeah. Dopa just killed all of them. Uh, JC Phoenix just stated, have you ever had uh, uh, the fact that you couldn't fly from East Asia, Asia to like Australia and stuff and had to go around uh, Africa? I haven't had that, to be honest. Usually the flying um, parameter is, is working out pretty, pretty nice, I would say. Look at that. This here could be a supremely good kill zone. Alright, teardrop. You're not really in cover there, mate. So, I would suggest you just get back here. Yeah, you, so it's true, the connection is definitely random generated, but usually, um, usually, it doesn't matter all too much, because uh, you will have 24 hours to complete a mission. I'm usually flying directly to the mission. So I'm just using kill zone, although I know that it's not going to work, because uh, the, the ranger is concealed. But yeah, why not? JC Phoenix is a real person, and guys, JC Phoenix was my second subscriber ever. So since um, yeah, you're one of uh, JC, uh, all of the guys know that your character uh, is regularly playing a big role. We even have him. Here. Wow, executed, nice. We even have him in this campaign, um, and you're my second subscriber, JC. Uh, follower, rather, not subscriber. Sorry. Lots and lots of shots been fired from the from the kill zone. Unfortunately, Velius is not hitting. 
What is wrong? Wow, he missed all of the shots and I think every shot was like 60 plus percent. He, he executed one, but failed to execute any of these others. And now he's out of ammunition. Good job, failures. Good job. No, I'm not going to blame him. He did the best. Best as he could. Um, this somehow tells me we would want to use one of our one of our acid grenades maybe yeah pro probably uh one of our gas grenades yeah probably so gas grenade would hit all of them back here On the move. barack obama now moving up We could either start on the right hand side or on the left hand side. On the right hand side, we do have this um, the uh, the psi operative, and I I don't want the psi operative to live through this. He needs to die. All of my old school subscribers got a tune in our in our uh, character pool. So you're no exception, bro. You're no exception. But JC Phoenix, really, uh, your tune came up often. Let's put it this way. Let it be luck or something else, but, uh, but your tune like was very present. All right, look at that, beautiful. This year, it's going to take care about so, so, so much. Out. Good. So the Psy Operative will die. Yep, promotion well earned. This guy here unfortunately won't die on his own, so we need to help a little bit. But yeah, that's no problem. We can help. We certainly can help. Let's start by bombarding this elite lancer. He dodged. That's okay. But I have a special delivery for you. Face off. Dopa Desor. Fighting them all at once. Yeah. And although they dodged, these two here, these two, will definitely die. There is no chance that they are going to survive. The damage over time, the dot, will just kill them. And now Velius can kill the last guy. And he will do that. Even got death from above for an extra kill. <laughs> Another dodge. This guy refuses to die. But yeah, whatever. He's not going to survive. Moving out. Affirmative. Covering now. <laughs> Over the fence. Ready to get pounded. All right, I think it's fair to say we cleared out most of the map. Let's take a short look about all of the other areas. Understood. Moving out. This guy here almost looks like 
a, f a faceless one. I could swear he's a faceless one. So I'm going to run and gun because I, I assume he's a faceless one. I knew it, bro. I knew it. All right, let's move up. This is going to be fun. Like all of this here. Will be in gas afterwards. I'm also taking the faceless one because yeah, why not? Like he should really take the initial damage as well. The screen is shaking now. Wow, could this please stop? I think once I, I aimed, it stops. No, it doesn't. Damn. Damn you, why is the screen shaking like that? Okay, let's start with the guys back here. I really it's hard to concentrate if the screen is, is literally shaking like that. All right, let's kill the faceless one. Good job, teardrop. Well done. Yeah, the screen shakes because of the berserk. Well, that's a fair assessment, but it shouldn't shake. The berserk is not crumbling on the ground, like stomping it the whole time. Maybe it is, but it shouldn't shake like all the ground. Yeah, Chet just rightfully said it's just a bug where the Berserker forgets to finish his rage. Hmm, I want to have the option for a Mimic Beacon, so let's not overdo this for now. Seventy-six percent on this elite lancer, good enough for me. Taken care of. I like it. I like it. The elite trooper is going to die regardless. The other elite trooper hasn't uh, hasn't received any damage so far. We could either start to damage him, or we just kill this guy plus... Um, yeah, that's probably better. Launching. So that's one kill, and the other guy just lost his cover, which means our sniper could just pretty much kill this guy. Yep. And since we killed someone, she has Implacable and can move back. Which means that the Berserker now has no one to, uh, to hit. Like it's literally out of range. So just in case, no of course we're not evacing, just in case, let's suppress it. 
we get a fair suppression, uh, suppression shot afterwards. And yeah. It's now enraging. It still has the reduced uh, to hit. And we'll get two overwatch shots. Plus we save the beacon. Yeah, there's still a gatekeeper. <coughs> not fun. Okay, so the Berserker decided not to move at all. Because yeah, suppression is too imba. It's OP. If you say so. Yeah, if I say so, it is too OP. We'll take a solid kill on this Berserker this round. Reload for Barrick Obama. Let's move him back here. By the way, I still have like lots of names. Teardrop, for instance, is none of my viewers. If you guys want to be the specialist who has already a hex skill improved. And by all means, just say so. Duchess as well, like, um, is also not... Um, the ranger that uh, whom we are using is also not a viewer. Her. You can have her position as well. Wow, so many units. It appears to be a constant, ongoing swarm. Unit after unit after unit after unit. And they are just not stopping. An acid grenade could take care about these uh, this huge armor. So yeah, let's just do that. Good job, Beric. Here we go. Oh, we even have three lighting hands. Hmm. I'm thinking like. Rupture on him would be really nice. An extra uh, an extra reaction shot would also be not too bad. But I think Rupture is better. So let's try to hit this time. Yeah, very nice. Wow, look at that. And now he's ruptured. That's good. We could go here for the high ground, but that would only mean that we have one shot against him. Probably not worth it. Let's take the free pistol. Uh, the free pistol shot didn't work out, and now we're again using fanfire because. I want to kill this guy really, really bad. Three misses in a row. Four misses in a row. Wow. <sighs> she's uh, going to place a Mimic Beacon. And I would also suggest that she's going to move a little bit more back. 
just to have some high cover and to not promote the um, the clustering here all too much. All right, so this here is going to be the beacon. Yeah, not not the best um, not the best lightning hands ever I'm however going to apply two kill zones here no three shots will not be enough like he had an advanced outloader right no I think he already reloaded so it's either three shots now or nothing. So let's instead take the three shots. Two kill zones. Two kill zones. A little bit of poison, a little bit of acid burn. And these guys are in the middle of everything. Acid burn for one. Did you also receive poison? No. All right, come on, come on, kill him. No way. Kill this eye, for fuck's sake! The gatekeeper needs to die. Yeah. Well, that was somehow foreseeable. Another miss. Could we please get... Yeah. Thank you so much. Good. At least the second kill zone wasn't, like, for nothing. Yeah, very clever to put yourself into poisonous gas, so you're reducing your own aim. That was... Um, AI at its finest. They really knew how to make this one work. So, solid pistol shot. Yep. Worked out well. Another lightning hands. Not going to take any timing. Well, we still have another grenade, don't we? So why... Don't we send our regards to these two gentlemen? Yep, pretty much worked out well. We can one-shot the soldier, and the shield bearer will be a little bit more problematic, but I, th I still think that's okay. Elite Trooper, 18 crit. Wow. Implacable. Let's just move here. She still has untouchable, so... I'm not worrying about her health. He's standing in the open, literally with his pants down. Okay, I'll go. I'll get him next time. Gonna need to reload soon. All right, two shots. 
first one already sealed the deal. And that should be it. Yay! Pretty much a war field, if you look at it. At the end, lots and lots and lots of corpses. Let's name the specialist after my dog, Agro. She's watching your stream when I am, so that's got to count for something. All right, since no one else wanted to have the name, Roby, I think your dog's uh, just as fine. Agro it is. It's a dog-like, semi-lupine, werewolf kind of specialist. Yep, fits the purpose. What kind of dog do you have, by the way? Now we know who will fetch the drop loot. <laughs> She's a swamp dog. Okay, that's fine for me. That's fine for me. Salvo or Hail of Bullets? I really like the Hail of Bullets. Uh, that went well with the remainder. But Salvo also was good. Hmm. Let's do Salvo for now. And the next one will be Hail of Bullets again. Get he brought up see. Impressive effort, Commander. My expectations were high, and yet you have exceeded them. Good, so Armory, new soldiers, and uh, we do have Teardrop, our specialist. So Teardrop now. No longer known as uh, as the man Teardrop. He's now known as the half man, half dog agro. I like it. Uh, a little bit expanded magazine, yeah, because yeah, why not? Oh, Cavalier Spaniel, these are nice. I really like them. Okay, so the game is not giving us any any rest. 100% uh, increased recruitment costs. Okay, chrysalids and an engineer. Also, we only need to destroy the alien relay. That's pretty simple. This one here is not going to happen. Like protect the device. Uh 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 uh. Not going to happen. Setting course for sector 15, West Asia. 